Wonderful, wonderful. Just uh, stop by any time. Of course. And basically when I do that, I hold up the drink and I take a sip from the drink. Does that cause anything? And he sips it. <laughs> <laughs> it's, a, it's a shot glass. So. <laughs> <laughs> I told you. <laughs> well, uh, he, he's never had the drink before, so he wants to at least make sure it's not going to kick him in the ass. <laughs> Yeah, you take the girly drink and then you sip it. No, it's just classic. It's a good thing well, you didn't test it. it, it I don't really sip it. I just had to test the... make... Did you have your pinky out? I was gonna say. <laughs> it's a good thing you didn't go to the more prospector friendly saloon back then. <laughs> the that would be the Thunder Horse, correct? <laughs> the um Thunder Horse Saloon. Hello, three. Hang on. It's um. There's probably like three saloons, but uh, 159. I uh, believe. Uh, Linstock Saloon is the one you passed. Ah, uh, okay, okay. <laughs> All right. Well, well, does it cause like what's the effect of like what's the reaction basically from drinking the drink? It, How strong is it? It's a pretty strong drink. It's a hundred proof. Oh, so I'm. Um, I don't really react outwardly, but I kind of I pull it back and just look at it a bit and. <laughs> Kind of just put it on the counter and just tap my hand on the counter. Do the girliest thing. Uh, no, I like this. <laughs> oh, this was too strong for me. He is such a he is such a dandy. <laughs> I'm the one with a constitution of six, and I'm gonna be drinking the hard. Wait, way. I'm such a damn what? <laughs> my character. A, what, what's a dandy? A dandy. <laughs> yeah, I guess that's how his that's how his royalty is gonna come out. He's a bit of a dandy. <laughs> a bit. Anyway. What happens next? Uh, well, he he just kind of seeing he's like I'll leave you to your drink then, and he just kind of goes back up the stairs and start he he uh, he basically pulls one of the the uh, pretty ladies that works the place. He pulls one of them aside and starts talking to her, and she's nodding, and that's about it. All right. Mm. Meanwhile. Okay. Meanwhile, at the Undertaker. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Fun. Uh, all these fuckers are dealing with all the bodies. I'm having to drink at a nice saloon. I'm a gambling, oh. very girly drink, and you're drinking it in a very girly way. <laughs> all right. Um, so this is uh, Thad uh, Thaddeus Jackson's. Yeah, Thaddeus Jackson. Thaddeus the Jackson. That's a pretty T. T. bad Jackson. name. Yeah. Thaddeus T. Jackson. All right. Um, well, once we we approach the um, Undertaker's uh, location, and well. Enter oh, enter his establishment. How does it smell in here? It smells like formaldehyde, to be honest with you. Uh, I'll take this over outside. Uh, I, I take the, my handkerchief off my face once I'm inside. I guess like, where is this place? Uh, I see Boot Hill, but I don't see. It's in it's in lot eight, upper left hand corner, L zero one. That's uh, ah. a. Yeah. Yes, of course. Constant area. Okay. Um, as soon as you enter, you see you see three people in here. The uh, the tallest fellow wearing the nicest suit. You presume to be uh, Mr. Jackson, the proprietor on the sign. Uh, he looks up, and you can actually see that uh, his gaze kind of goes in two different directions. Probably because one of his eyes is uh, made of glass. He goes, "Yes." Uh, hello, uh, sir. The, the sheriff sent us. We uh, there's an incident outside of town, and we have a few corpses that you uh, will need to attend to. Oh dear, I'm so sorry for your loss. Oh, no, uh, we no, didn't know were... them personally, but uh, it was tragic anyway. Regardless, they were they were assaulted and slain no more than three hours ago or so. It's rather gruesome. Uh, since I have family out east, I uh, think it would be best if we hold off on the burial until uh, word can be sent in case they want to send the bodies back. But uh, perhaps you can hold on to them for the time being. This is not a problem. If you simply show me to where they are, I'll go get my tape measure. All right. Uh, they're in the my cart, and I'll lead him to where I have my cart with the wise one. He, he, uh, he, he says, I know it is not my business to pry, but um, where will you all be staying? so that I might uh, inquire after billing purposes. Mm. Uh, the, uh, the sheriff said he'd handle that business. Uh. Oh, I see. So he, 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 uh, he, he basically 
takes his sweet tamp damn time kind of measuring out the bodies. Hmm. Uh, will, will you need uh, help carrying them? Uh... Oh, you're too kind. Yes. That would be I'm going to say lad, and I'm going to gesture to uh, Juan, see if he can give us some help. You can okay. help us, Juan? Just yes. as, I'll assist as well in the matters. Okay, so after a while, you've, you've unloaded the bodies, and uh, he, he tips his, his long black hat towards you, and he says, If you ever feel need of my services, I have the best prices in town. <laughs> in fact, the only price is in town. <laughs> it's a bit of a joke. I'll be inside. <laughs> Creepy. Anyway. Uh, under I, Undertaker's always the most pleasant of people. I found him quite creepy myself. I was. That's beat. my straight shooter stuff coming out. Yeah. <laughs> Indeed. Um, let's head back to. Let's head back to that gambling hall. I believe at this point. Probably the best it, place. Uh, I think sure it's sure. Probably know to look for us there. Or one of the right. Let's see if drink does sound nice right about now, and at least does the smell those corpses is gone. Ugh. Who was it that owned that uh, gambling hall again? Was it? It was just right around the corner. Yeah, it's right. It's just right down that way. I said who uh, owned it? I mean, I, I know who owns it, but I was just since saying my character forgot, so I was going to have It's uh, it's a Mr. Langdon, I believe. Oh yes, he's uh, one of the uh, land brokers, I believe, according yes. to the signs at least. I, I would like to talk to him. I would like to procure some land in the uh, town. Oh, as would I. As would I. Need a, need a, unless they want me to run a clinic on the streets, but we'll find out. Anyways, we shall be off. Yeah, so I guess I'm going to... I guess we're both heading back to the uh, tavern. All three of us are... Yeah, I understood you. Um, I'm just looking to see something. Well, I'm still I'm still getting used to the the town myself, trying to find out where everything is. Uh, no, I, I know where the I know where the tavern is. I'm looking for something else. I'm trying to see if there's actually a hotel in town. But I there, is, um, there is. There is a hotel. Pal uh, Pal 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 Nine L O Six. And it's at the south end of the block that the yeah. gambling hall. It's, the, it's a sort of oblong-shaped building, like a T, upside-down T. It's a Tetris piece. Yeah, it's yeah, a Tetris piece. The name implies it's a, a luxurious hotel, so it's probably a piece of shit. <laughs> Indeed. What was the name again? The, the gambling hall or the, or the hotel? The hotel. Palace Hotel. Yeah, Palace Hotel is probably the worst looking place in the bunch. Uh. <laughs> Not to give you any ideas, but... Okay, one more second. I'm just looking to see one more thing. One, if you want, I'll take a dollar off of my sheet. You can add it to yours for your payment for today. No, I have money. Well, yeah, but I'm still going to pay you. Well, right. Okay, so you all head into the uh, you all head into the gambling hall and find it's much the same as, as Squeaks found. In fact, you actually kind of intercept him coming out, and he's like, this place is great. They have such cool drinks. <laughs> and just oh. as an aside, you notice that there's a drink on the counter that happens to still be mostly full. Hmm. <laughs> uh, it's good to breathe some air that's not outside. Uh. I'm going to uh, try and uh, gather up everyone who I can find who was present at the uh, incident. So just the rest of the party, if I can find them, so I can uh, fill them in on what the sheriff said. Actually, um, no, never mind. I actually have the drink in my hand. How about that? I'm still, I'm still working on the drink. <laughs> You're still working on the shot glass. Of... As an aside, I'll mention to him, like you know, you're supposed to down that in one go, right? 
Shh. And I sip it again. I just kind of give him. A, I give him a defiant look and just kind of sip it again. I like to savor it. <laughs> I like yes. I like to savor the flavor. It's actually a very unique drink. You should try it. I'll have a. I'll all have right. A so while well, you guys are all sharing your drinks, <laughs> I'm gonna say to the group. Oh, we talked to the sheriff here. He would appreciate it if we stayed in town for now, uh, pending uh, setting an investigation out there. I'm sure he would have particular interest in with the uh, gentleman who managed to find the, the tracks. Which would be Bane. I don't plan on leaving this place anytime soon, as long as I'm still welcomed. Let me take another sip. But, uh, <laughs> in the meantime, we can uh, attend... Can I get a straw? <laughs> you, 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 you know they make little you know the little paper umbrella is not supposed to be in a shot glass right mm, that's good <laughs> okay so I'm gonna okay. after I tell them that just briefly that we're supposed to stay in town for now I will go up to the bar lay down my chip on the uh, counter and say oh, I do believe uh, this will get me a free drink I actually follow him up to, um, who are you again? Who am I? Yeah, name. Daniel Darcy. Nice to Daniel. meet you. Nice to meet oh, you. this is our character. You, you can call say me whiskey, Dan. you say whiskey and clang pour. He gives you a whiskey. <laughs> yeah. I, put I, I, on, I, I, I put my hand I, on the dar um, dapper shoulder and go like, this is a good friend of mine. I don't know much uh, about him, actually. Take a noise, <laughs> He's a good friend of mine, but I don't know much about him. I don't know much about him, but I've traveled with him. He's good company. I nod to the bartender and, but I might my oh, my chip and strange, indeed, ask huh? for whiskey as well. So, sip again. And I ask for a glass of milk. Oh, uh, where was this whiskey made? If I, if you don't mind me asking. Where was this whiskey made? It's well, Kentucky, I would imagine. <laughs> oh well, I'm from Ireland. We make our whiskey up there. Yeah, you make very it. famous Irish whiskey. It's so you you make you make your whiskey without me though, isn't it? <laughs> It's like whiskey, W H I S K Y. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> yeah, you, ours has an E in it. <laughs> uh, well, I prefer the Irish stuff, but us stuff us will do suffice. So, down to the bottom because I'm a man. Uh, Scott, I'm Irish. I know how to drink whiskey. I butt in. I butt in a bit. I'm like very astute of you, bartender. You must be a very intellect, very intelligent individual. I take another sip. Thank you. I, I follow uh, along and. Just, okay, uh, everyone, make a make a tolerance drink. Uh, you make a tolerance factor roll. So you gotta uh, roll a uh, roll a twenty and add your constitution. <laughs> roll a d twenty. Oh, hey, I'm drinking milk. Unless, drink, unless you're drinking milk. Unless you're drinking milk. You're drinking milk. All right. So um, how do we roll? Fourteen. This? Oh, it's actually a twenty. So is that good? At with no. constitution, twenty-eight. Is it one? Okay, one d twenty plus. Oh wow, natural. Nice. That's what I John. Oh, 31. Uh make sure you use um just use uh braces uh just basic braces uh, or brackets. Is it straight lines brackets or braces? It should look like a Okay. Wow, even with a natural 20 there's no way to for him to save against the uh oh another is he saved. Oh. Bas basically for every for every two drinks that you don't roll, you you don't Succeed. Uh, your your speed goes up by one, and your actually goes down by one. So that's right. that's how it simulates getting more drunk. So you don't immediately get drunk after this, but if you like, if if you d you need to roll basically like a like a thirty. Oh, mm -hmm. so so even though I have low constitution, a high constitution is not going to help that much unless you're really lucky. I I I didn't I didn't successfully roll, but okay. <laughs> well, yeah, there's there's a talent called hold your liquor, so yeah. Yep. I need to wait. I, I I need some help. I'm gonna try and uh, find uh, this. Uh, okay. So what what is your constitution score? My constitution Nine. is thirteen. So it'd be one d twenty. I I, know, I don't know the macro. Oh, there you go. That's it. Okay. Just just what? Square got brackets. It. I got it. Uh, I just went up to the bar and asked for whatever the other guys were getting. All right, I got fifteen. For God's sake, man. Well, luckily, it doesn't matter how much you fail it by. Just <laughs> all right. So, all right. It, it's not a big deal. It's just most people, most of the time, are not going to succeed at this one. It's really just a factor of like if you've got a cast iron stomach, you know whether or not you can. Which I guess so the only one here is Bane. 
southern gentleman knows how to hold his whiskey.